Hello guys, welcome. Welcome back on a technology welfare. Let's learn and what's with practical in this tutorial. How to go back to iOS 15, 15.5, 16, 16.5 from iOS 17. Sometimes needed. Yes, due to bug or some technical glitch or issues. Once again, we would like to go back. So how do you do it without data loss? So firstly, we will check it out manually. Then we will come with the computer. So we will tap on the setting, setting to, of course, we will tap on a general, general to our software update. So see, it has started to check it out. And it's saying that 17.0 iOS is up to that. We don't have any opportunity to go back iOS 16, 16.5, 15, 15.5. So of course now we will come with the computer. Is it possible? Yes, we will come with this tool that is a reboot iOS system repair. Of course, this tool is specially designed by Tinocia. Here, see we have a one feature that if your device has been stuck on the recovery mode or DFU mode, you can with no one click you can exit. If you would like to reset your device, this can be of course with no one click by a tap here. And here, 150 plus iOS issues that can be fixed. Either it is a iPod Touch, iPhones, iPad, Apple TV, all kind of the iOS system issues that can be fixed. For example, your device has been stuck on the Apple logo, rebooting again and again, black screen is coming. Of course, this kind of the issues that can be easily fixed by using this tool. So right now, see this. This device has been connected with the help of data cable. Now I would like to downgrade. Here is option to upgrade and downgrade. But I would like to downgrade. So of course it has, see here, we have a two more, 16, and this is an upgrade. So this one I would like to downgrade. So just we will click here. Now see, 17 iOS is currently functional on this device. Now I would like to go back. So here is opportunity given, see. Yes, 16.5. When I will be reached on the 16.5, and then definitely I will get one more downgrade option that will be a 16. So here, I will start to download. So now see here, it has started to download. But here, internet speed is uh, quite slow, so it will take a time to complete. Total size of this IPSW is uh, approximately more than 6 GB, so especially it will take a five to ten minutes so video will be lengthy guys after downloading of course simply you have to click to next and of course it will start to a downgrade so this is all about in this video tutorial and to know more information about this tool you can visit on this website and that is a tinoshare.com as we see here there are the various kind of the feature of this you can fix also iTunes errors Yes, you can reset iPad, iPod without iTunes also, as well as you can repair iTunes errors like for the 13, uh, 4000, especially I mean 5, 4013 with the simple click stickers. And it will support all the iOS version and devices including the latest. So this is all about in this video tutorial, guys. Yes, discount coupon key. Links I will give you below the description box if you are in Christmas. Blindly had a yes, blindly had below the description box to get this website links to buy or free downloads. So this is all about in this video tutorial, guys. Thank you, thank you very much, indeed. Have a great time. Bye bye.